Hi, this is Rick, and this is a quick video tutorial for uh, La Bella Lucy. It's a uh, solitaire card game, um, and this particular version is on my website, labellalucy.com. It's a pile-based card game, uh, so you have these 18 piles, uh, mostly of three, with this one of one. Uh, and as you know, in most solitaire card games, you have four suit piles that you're trying to build up from ace to king by suit. Um, the piles, though there are many, uh, are kind of tough to build on because you have to build them down uh, by suit. Unlike in some solitaire card games where you could say alternate colors, that makes things you know, a lot easier. Um, but these you have to build by suit. Uh, so we'll start out by moving some of the cards over here. Now I, think I have double click. Yeah, I have double click um, in this game. So you could double click a card to move it over there or you know, you could pick it up and drag it. Now I see a, a ace of hearts under this two of hearts. And I see a three of hearts there. So I can move the two of hearts onto the three of hearts. And then I can drag over the uh, ace of hearts into the suit piles. And I'm just going to double click these two to, to move them over. Um, then there's the four of hearts. So I can move that over. Um, now a king on the bottom is actually a really good thing because... Uh, that that doesn't happen a whole lot, um, you know. So that's kind of nice because now I can move the queen and the jack, and it's not going to block anything. Uh, things typically get blocked when there is a larger card over a smaller one of the same suit. If you can't, you know, move that, and the kings are particularly bad about blocking things. Uh, most of my kings seem to be in the bottom, but that freed up the ace of clubs. Which I can move over there now. Um, let's see. There's a two of spades. But I don't see a three of spades anywhere. So if I move that, I'm not going to be able to get him out of the way. I can move this guy. Hmm. I see that five. I'd like to move this four over here. But that's going to make it harder to get to this ace. However, the six is way down there. So I don't know that I'm going to be able to get to it anyway. So I'm just going to move this four over here, and that frees up the two of diamonds, or two of spades to move over. Um, do I have a queen of diamonds? Because that would be nice to put on there. That is, that is underneath this three. Now, I think I mentioned this, but if I didn't, you can only move the top card on any pile. So I apologize if I didn't mention that before. Um, I really need to figure out how to free up that ace of diamonds. So anyway, you kind of continue like this <clears throat> until you get stuck and you can't make any other moves, which almost certainly will happen. Um, I don't think I've ever played a game through uh, where I was able to make it all the way through without shuffling. Um, now, one thing to note, notice there's no cards here, and you think, oh, well, that's great, because then I could just move a card on top of it to start another one or even move a king, but you can't move any of the cards into where a pile was. Uh, once a card, once a pile is is empty, uh, it's it's done. It's gone for good. You cannot move anything into it, which is one of the reasons kings are very good at blocking other cards, because you can't really do anything. You can't move a king from one pile to another. You can only move it uh, into the um, into the suit piles. But anyway, let's say I'm stuck. I don't think I I am. I think I could make more moves here. But let's say I'm stuck and I can't make any more moves. You have three shuffles. That you can use in any game and that will shuffle all of these cards that are not in the suit piles that are in the the normal pile so i click that and it shuffles all the cards and oh look at that it freed up the ace of diamonds and now i can move the two of diamonds onto it i can move the two of clubs um and i'm sure that i could probably go for a while here before i have to shuffle again uh, it's frequent that I have to use all three shuffles to win. Um, sometimes I can use two. Uh, I think I may have had a game or two where I've only needed to use one shuffle. That is really rare for me anyway. Uh, but it's very typical to have to use all three of your shuffles to win. Um, it's, it's a pretty challenging game. Not every hand is winnable. Uh, I mean, frequently it comes down to whether or not you get lucky on the last shuffle because if a king is blocking something you need uh, you know you're you're on the last shuffle you're kind of uh hosed but it's a fun game um 
it's not a particularly quick play, so I'm not going to play all the way through it. Uh, but it's a good time. It's on labellalucy.com. Uh, check it out if you get a chance.